Yes, yes, no one likes the icky stuff. Yes, a perfect world. Sounds magical. <laughs> I can hardly stand the weight. And here I thought Mimi's ideal world was a gem-filled pool filled with hunky lifeguards. Hmm, I do enjoy a good chunking. Well then, I believe I'll head out as well. <laughs> it won't be that easy, oh no. So very nice to meet you and your mustache. I am Count Blex, Master of Dimensions, the pleaser of crowds. I am Dementio. Remember the name well. It would be so very dull if your journey ended so easily. Instead, it ends with magic. Yes, much better. Now you and this robotic guardian can spend some quality time. Yes, quality snack time, when he snacks on you, for you are the snack. Ciao. And so I arrive, like a sudden windstorm at a kindergarten picnic. Your wish is my command. Besides, this fool sounds like an amusing challenge. Now, if there is nothing else, I'll just be on my way. Ciao, my count. <laughs> Finally you arrive. You don't wear tardiness well. At last, the hero. I know of you from the festival of hair that dances upon your lip. I am a humble servant of Count Black, Master of dimensions, pleaser of crowds. I am Dementio. It is truly enchanting to finally meet my hapless victims. I have prepared a special morsel of a treat for you. How about some magic? And voila! You are now in dimension D, a dimension of my own creation. In this mind-bending realm, my attacks are 256 times more potent. I am now far more powerful. I could obliterate you with the raise of an eyebrow. Now we must duel, like two gleaming banjos on a moonlit stoop. Can you pierce this illusion? <sighs> Your blows are like major jackhammers wielded by tiny, angry road workers. How is this possible? This dimension makes me 256 times more powerful. <laughs> Of course! This was simply an amusement that played out exactly as I planned. Were you amused? That was just an hors d'oeuvre. The next time we meet, you will feast on a deadly eight-course meal. And with that, my diminutive limbed foe, I must say... Ciao! Hmm... A little more, perhaps? They are strong, but they must be stronger yet to defeat Black. I must make sure they can face him when the time comes around at last. And that is how the ruffians manage to best me. <laughs> they are strong to be sure. Very strong. Dare I say, they might be strong enough to defy the prophecy. Oh my! That's the first time that morsel of information has touched my ears. Do tell. As you command, Count. Hail Black! My, 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 how interesting. Natasha and the Count have such deep conversations. Hmm, just what is our dear Count playing at? Ah, well, I'll let him worry about that. I must attend to my own... projects. So what you're saying is, the man in green is our minion in training, Mr. L.? My, aren't we hot-blooded? Well, well, I suppose that's to be admired. Now, if you'll excuse me, I've got to be on my way as well. Ciao! Salutations, O-Chunks! Ah, once again we meet. 
like two large hairy Vikings on a storm tossed schooner. Ah, a quadrillion pardons. Far be it from me to be a hindrance. Far, far be it. As it happens, I merely have an acquaintance in this land. I was just saying hello. Yes, truly. And I saw you and I thought, perhaps my magic can aid in this fight. Ah, rest assured, I'll hardly be underfoot. You fight to your heart's content. Ciao! Well, salutations, O oh Chunks. How are things, hmm? Yes, yes, of course, I understand. Your honor must be satisfied. But, O oh Chunks, before you let your game be over, humor poor little me for a bit. I have something I'd rather think you'll enjoy. I do wish you would try it out for me. Oh, it's not the time, hmm? Not the time for something that will aid Count Black? Ah, it is time to part. Ciao! Ah, <laughs> so at long last you've come to play like late sleeping toddlers. Ah, do you not tire of collecting those worn out tiresome pure hearts? I am not violent by nature, you know. I'd prefer to sell this peacefully, in fact. Say, for instance, you wish to go back to your world. I could do that for you. <laughs> so it must be. Shall we begin? My, my, aren't you plucky. Same fight, same outcome. You are precisely correct. And that is why... Lovely green hat, wouldn't you say? Dear old Chunks, so strong, yet so very dim. A child could learn his attack patterns. As such, I request a few sprouts from my acquaintance to liven him up a touch. I call the boy O-Cabbage. Don't be shy, O-Cabbage. Introduce yourself. <laughs> Simply adorable. Now remember, kids, eat your vegetables to grow big. Except in this case... A veggie will eat you. Have fun now. Ciao. <laughs> hmm, if they could beat that ball of O-Chunks, then they are coming along quite nicely. Perhaps they really are the ones I have waited for all this time. <laughs> I should prepare myself as well. So much to do, so precious little time. <laughs> Hard to stay still when you pine for sweet vengeance, isn't it? The Count's orders are all absolute, completely without exception, yes? We shouldn't even dare to think of our secret sneak attack. Perish the thought! Defeating the hero would please the Count greatly, but we must follow orders. <laughs> my, my, isn't that something? I do believe I should be moving on as well. Ah-ha-ha! <laughs> Did they wound your fragile pride, Mr. L? Demolish your robot again? Perhaps that is for the best. You said it yourself. You can't go back to the cow now. So get lost. Such temper! Your nostrils, they flare out like the hood of a hissing cobra. I can't have you around the Count. If I'm rid of you here, I will be found out, and the others will never find you. Yes, this is my moment to grasp. It's time for you to take your final bow, Mr. L. <laughs> Shh! Don't worry, it won't be so bad. I promise. I'll send those heroes your way soon, just so you'll have someone to play with. Ciao, Mr. L. Ah ha ha! The forlorn group of heroes, how they cry! The tears flow like sad chowder. Oh, bad news for you. There is no way in this world to restore the pure heart. Yes, sadly, your hard work was all in vain. Ah ha ha! Yes, it does. 
And that's why I decided to give you a consolation prize. It's quite simple. I fulfilled their wishes. I sent them to the next world. Ha <laughs> ha You do know who I am, right? I am your enemy, Dementio. I serve Count Black. Well, as pleasant as this has been, I must leave. Ciao. Ha <laughs> ha Oh, I'm afraid so, my Count. In fact, they will be here before long. Well, I'm not one to miss a party. Oh, but wait one moment. Dear Count, does the name Blumier ring a bell? Oh, the mustache man's pixel went on and on. She said, I must stop Blumier. But I suppose there's no reason to pay any mind to the ramblings of a pixel. Ciao for now, my Count. <laughs> So, you've made it at last. Oh, but what's this? You seem to be missing the Ravishing Princess and the Arm Flailer. Ah, I see. You're in a hurry. Allow me to get out of your way, then. Just as soon as you defeat me. <laughs> you've proven to be worthy foes in the past, so I'm not going to make it easy. You'll have to come get me first. It'll be like a game of tag. With magic. Enjoying my game of tag? Messing around? Oh no, magic is no laughing matter. I am always deadly serious. I have been watching you. You're the only ones who can stand up to Count Black. So, I have a favor to ask. Will you help me... Destroy the Count? Betray him? <laughs> oh no, it is Count Black who has betrayed me! He said he would destroy all worlds and create a new perfect world in their place. But he was lying! He plans to obliterate every world and then keep them all in ruin! I have always known about his nefarious goal, but I could never hope to stop him on my own. I feigned loyalty to him as I searched for someone who could defeat him with me. Well, you see, that is why I rescued the princess from brainwashing. It's also why I sent you to the underwear to fix the broken pure heart. And why I freed a man to be reunited with his brother. Now do you see? Ah, you've got me pegged. Now, how about you return the favor? I'll give you the power you need to crush Count Black. Just fight by my side. Still you refuse? But this offer, it drips with generosity. With the chaos hot in our hands, we can rule every world. Do you still refuse? So you spit upon my offer. You have wasted my time. For that, your game ends. I think I'll start with the green one. The shag upon his lip will make a fine trophy. <laughs> How tender! I just squeezed out a tear. Yes, Mario can run along. And if he somehow manages to defeat Count Black on his own, all the better. And so I strike, like an unseen dodgeball in an echoing gymnasium. No! I, I cry, Uncle! Mercy! Uncle, I say! I, I see that now. Your power is formidable. Which is exactly why I can't let you fall into complex velvet lined gloves. <laughs> I have you now, Luigi. We will both taste the agony of game overing. By magic. Ciao. Silly assistant. Absorbing my attack to protect him. What an adorably hopeless gesture. I was about to give her the everlasting peace he so desperately wants. <laughs> of course, this is my moment. Even if the cow dies, the chaos heart won't disappear if I get you to control it. But I need the power of the pure hearts to beat him. I couldn't do that on my own. So I had you do all the sweaty labor for me. 
And you even used your pure hearts to defeat Count Black. If they make greeting cards to thank people for helping with evil plans, I owe you one. I'm saying that you no longer have value to me, so I'm ending your games. They're all yours, Mr. L. When I sent Luigi here, I planted a seed in the fertile soil of his unconscious, and now that seed has sprouted spectacularly. Mr. L, run along now and get ready for your big entrance. Now, ladies and gentlemen, get ready for the greatest magic show you'll ever see! The Dark Prognoscius says he's the ideal host for the power of the Chaos Heart. And now I'm going to add my own power to this spicy little concoction. Count Black, you look so tired and pathetic I nearly forgot about you. I'll squeeze the life out of you later. Just wait over in that dimension, okay? Great. Now the Chaos Heart is mine. I will use it to destroy all worlds and create perfect new ones. So, shall we get started? Now I have all I need to become the king of all worlds. <laughs> I am now invincible. There is nothing you can do. And now it is time for the destruction to begin. Let it begin with you, as you wallow in helplessness like upside down turtles. Cool power! <laughs> Let's stop wasting time and finish this, shall we? Ciao! What? What's going on? No! The pure hearts! I thought you wished them all fighting Count Black! What's happening? I'm not invincible anymore! How did you do it? How could I have lost with the power of Luigi and the Chaos Arts? And the prophecy? Has it been undone? This is the end. This isn't finished. You can't stop this now. You can't escape. I've been saving one last surprise. Ciao! <laughs> <laughs>